Like it ain't no thing. Welcome to day 14. Everything yeah, good? Day 14. Yeah, we, we did, did it. <laughs> we made it to day 14 and we're all still here. <laughs> we survived a beautiful night at a lake. It was just yeah. the worst. It was so <laughs> terribly beautiful. Yeah. It was rough. Yep. Anyhow, we're looking at a 386 kilometer day today, but um, pretty slow because the estimated time is five hours. That might be due to construction or something, but. It's, it's going to be a longish day, especially because we have a bunch of stops. It's going to be a really beautiful part of the trip. Yeah. Um, and then our plan is to end up in Watson Lake. We will finally be getting into the Yukon. Yeah, yes. our first day in the Yukon. Our first territory. Yeah. Very exciting. It yeah. is very exciting times. What you doing, names? I mean, I got this pretty handy dandy <laughs> sticker here um, for explorations. Hashtag at explorations evo. No big deal. Um, and so, yeah, I'm gonna add it as part of our trip to my luggage because everyone should know what we're doing. So I'm gonna just do it now. I've already pre-cleaned it as per what you should do. Let's just go with that. All right, now let's, we'll buff it out, but I think she looks pretty good. Dude, that looks bomb. <laughs> That's, That's awesome. pretty all right. That fits perfectly. Yeah. Heck yeah. Nice. We're official. All right. Kanaskin Provincial Park. Pretty nice park. We are moving onwards though. <laughs> to hopefully even more cool things. <laughs> On the road again. Hey guys, so we're hanging out on our journey, uh, leaving the lake and wouldn't you know it, we want some gas and can you see that? It's a it's lovely little working. out of order. Yeah. So yeah, good good news is we have jerry cans. So that's cool. Um, so we're just gonna kind of ride our bikes out, hope for the best and yeah, when we need the jerry cans, we'll use them. The good news is this is kind of what we prepared for already. And it's you know, not it, a crisis. It's not a crisis at all. And in 80K, there is the gas station. So I think our bikes, the KLRs will make it no problem. Our cool little sport bike friend uh, might not make it, but you know, that's fine. We don't need him on this trip anyways. He'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be fine. That's why we got jerry cans. Oh my God. Yeah, that's a nice look. I'm gonna keep my helmet on. <laughs> so 80K till gas, cause there's no gas here. We'll be fine. Right Ian? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna see how far we get. I'm optimistic. Oh, he's getting serious pose. Two fifty-four. Uh, technically, I should be able to make eighty k.
deserved, but we all made it. Our friends are here too. Yep. This is super important. What do we got here? Right beside Arizona. Bam. So Watson Lake, where we want to go. But there's this campsite here that'll keep it short to get to Whitehorse tomorrow along this twisty, curvy, super fun thing. Yeah, so we're basically sacrificing 50 kilometers today or 50 mm -hmm. kilometers less tomorrow. Yeah. Which is gonna make today real long. Yeah. But. Real long to a campsite. It still won't be our longest day. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I think we just play it by ear a little bit more as we get longer in the day. This is definitely a significantly cooler spot than where we were. <laughs> I mean, there was a certain je ne sais quoi about that toilet paper covered gravel thing you were sitting on. But I feel like this is a little bit nicer. Look at the color of this water too. That's so cool. Also, you can tell it's getting smoky because that looks like it's kind of dusk right now, the lighting. But uh, it's midday. There's a bit of a red hue to things, but it is absolutely midday. So. For a minute. But you look really cool taking an underwater photo of Damien. It's so nice. It's like I can spend a lot of time here. Yeah. <laughs> so how much further to the portage? Forty feet. All right. <laughs> But look at this view, oh, yeah, though. Back to Portage Town, I guess. Not with this canoe or not. So cool, but through this water, it's I know. so clear. <laughs> it work for the canoe. Yeah, <laughs> that is pretty low. That's yeah, but it'll work. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, I know. There's a few of them in here. <laughs> yeah, really. Probably an old dock of sorts. Maybe. A delicious lunch. A cool park. On our way to Alaska, and by Alaska I mean Yukon, with the Alaska Highway. <laughs> stop for 40 kilometers because of this fire. That is so crazy. So this is going to be very exciting.
It's so crazy the amount of area that's been burned here. We've been driving through this for like, what, 40 kilometers almost? Yeah. And it's on fire again, apparently. Whew. I'm gonna go for it. You want me to do it first? Oh, I thought you were gonna go first. I got you going up. Like it ain't no thing. We did it. It's larger than life. The top? Way up there? Yeah. How tall do you think I am? Like eight feet tall? Isn't that accurate? Aren't you eight feet tall? I'm gonna put it right here. All right. You do, you. Oh my god, that's great. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. One more territory to go on this ship, and then we'll have hit two of the three territories. <laughs> it's our first river crossing into Yukon. It's a pretty nice bridge. People kayaking down there, that's pretty fun. Sappho's Forest. Wow. Pretty cool. This is about all I can say about this signpost forest though. But uh, the bigger news is that we made it through this great forest fire where we couldn't actually stop. Um, some very official officials were telling us <laughs> to keep driving. And we did. And we did. And we escaped into the Yukon. Got some fancy photos in front of the sign. And now we're at the um, signpost forest. In Watson Lake. In Watson Lake. Look at all the signposts. There's a lot of them. Boise, like California, Virginia, Poland, Texas. Australia. I saw one from yeah. Australia. So pretty cool. Queensburg, <laughs> Wasaga Beach, Ontario. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Pretty cool. Deutschland. Yeah. Huge. And um, giant. We didn't bring our own signpost from where we're from, but we did bring one of our stickers. Oh yeah, so, stick there's some up. stickers right there. Yeah, yeah, sticker so we, town. We gotta find somewhere sweet to stick this bad boy. Yeah, 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 I love it. I have it on good information that there's over a hundred thousand signs in this signpost forest, which I can believe. I 100% believe that. I mean, it came from a somewhat reliable source. <laughs> it did come from a somewhat reliable source. <laughs> I'm joking. You're reliable. All right, boys, we slapping the sticker on something or what? Yeah. What, what tickles your fancy in here? All right, it's going on the back of this sign here, facing the sun so we get all that foily goodness. Damien's yeah. doing the honors. Oh, oh my oh, God! No. Got it, we got Almost it. Oh my God. God. Pressure is too great. It was too much. Yeah. It's too much pressure. Okay, 
by the power vested in me by Rob and Ian who want to hang out with me and do this trip. I dub the exploration sign. Woo! Yeah. Woo. Exploration sign. Come and try and find it. Yeah, good luck everybody. Yeah, it's really, we couldn't find anything. There's 10,001 now. <laughs> yeah. That was the signpost for us. Moving on. Well, we're here. Slightly uh, bugged up lens, but this is Big Creek Campground. We're at the Big Creek Bridge. We're gonna go check out the Big Creek, which is under the Big Creek Bridge. There we go. Big Creek. <laughs> right beside a big swamp. Yeah. Some wonder there's mosquitoes here. Yeah, who would have thought, right? No, I know. Weird. All these northern mosquitoes. <laughs> Look at that sky, too. Oh. It looks pretty rainy. It looks like rain is in our future. I think so. It's very pretty though. It is very pretty. In an ominous sort of way. Yeah. I like sleeping in a thunderstorm. Yeah, totally. I don't like packing up and then riding for a day in thunderstorms. <laughs> yeah, that's the unfortunate side of it, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Day 15. Oh, We're going yeah. from... We didn't actually go to Watson Lake. Sorry, we didn't end at Watson Lake yesterday. We went to Watson Lake, checked out the samples for us, and then we drove to Big Creek Campground, which is about 40 kilometers west of Watson Lake. Woo woo! So we have a 40 kilometer start on today. Uh, we're going to Whitehorse. Big day. Woo! That was me clapping for it. It is a big day. Yes. And uh, we have 399 kilometers today. So not the longest day, but also not the shortest day. Yeah. Yeah. You can tell by our amazing style right now that it's a, it's a rainy day. So forecast calls for pretty heavy rain potentially, but it's like 40 to 60% chance. Um, but obviously we're not gonna chance it on a trip like this. We're gonna wear our rain gear so that the rest of the trip doesn't get yeah. just miserable. So we're just <laughs> wet for the next 30 days. Yeah, that sounds like a bad <laughs> time. Yeah. 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 Uh -huh. Anyhow, here's our route <laughs> on our crappy crappy map. Thanks, man. There we go. Teslin is kind of the halfway point. Hopefully we can get some gas somewhere on route because I think we're going to need it. And yeah. Although we did get a chance to test our gas range yesterday. So. Oh boy, did we ever. Yeah, yeah. so I'm we're... we're my range. Yeah, exactly. 340 for your little sports bike, which is good. 322, actually. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So that's not bad. Yeah. Not bad. Not doing bad for gas. Yeah. Hopefully the weather's good. We got our rain gear on, so it won't rain is the idea. Yeah. And so, our buddy Colin isn't here, who is the rain god who yeah, always he's makes like the it rain. Maker. So, you know, fingers crossed it'll go well. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Let's do it. Another interesting fact in 37 kilometers, we're going to hit the 6,000 kilometer mark of this trip. Hopefully, I remember to record it when it happens. I probably won't, so I'm telling you now. But yeah, 6,000 kilometers, and then another 1,500 kilometers from that point to the Arctic Ocean. We're so close, but also still kind of far. Let's go!
Gute Fest! Alright, let's check out Rancheria Falls. Five hundred meters, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> we are here. Five hundred meters. I'm curious about what this big white area is. Like a gravel? Gravel bed? I guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, exactly. A very fancy boardwalk. Look at it. Just like Ian, he's also very fancy. Pretty nice. If you, I would definitely slide down that fall. Totally. Probably a little chilly, but you know, Almost not too shabby. Chilly. Yeah. <laughs> it goes even further this way too. Let's go see. Oh yeah. It's a little more waterfally. The Rancheria River, Rancheria Falls. At least I think it's the Rancheria River. I'm pretty sure that's what it said on the map. Very nice. That was Rancheria Falls. A pretty fun little waterfall hike. This is the village of Teslin. This is the rest stop outside the village of Teslin. Let's take a look. I'm assuming this is the Teslin River that we're going over. Ah, pretty fun lookout. Teslin Lake. It's a big old lake. I bet you if we could get all our bikes down here, that'd be a really good shot. Uh, yeah, that would be. Got a drop in right around the corner. Yeah. I like influencing people to do bad ideas. This is a great idea. This is a bad idea. Perfect. It's the right attitude, Rob. <laughs> so <soft. Yep. laughs> it sounds so funny to hear a sports bike do this. I love it so much. All right, look at this photo op. Woo. Very nice. So, we're at the beach. 
pretty nice. Nice lovely beach. Ian's lovely bike made it down, no problem. No problems at all. Uh, what we're gonna do now is have to get back up though. It's a bit of an uphill. We just saw Rob, arguably the most capable of all of our bikes, spin up his rear tire trying to get up. So yeah, I guess I'll try and then Ian will try and we're all gonna have a really good time, I think. That's how that's gonna go. Shenanigans. Ugh. <laughs> Man, bikes are fun. Now for the main attraction. Where is he? <laughs> there you are. <laughs> there you are. Huh? Is that a Suzuki Panda? It is, yeah. <laughs> he's got uh, 80 20 tires on it, though, so he's not 100% at a disadvantage. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Get a motorcycle wash if you park here. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hello. Oh, oh my Gucci. Oh, you're just <laughs> such a little one. You were very excited yeah. to come see us. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Awesome. I like this place already. <laughs> All museums should come with dogs. Hey, bud. Please don't pee on my bike. He's peeing on Ian's bike. <laughs> the Heritage Center is unfortunately closed. Which is disappointing. It looks really, really neat inside. But uh, we did get some fun photos by these totems. So, partial win. And we saw cute dogs, which was a huge win. So, I'd still call this stop a success. All right, this is our house. It's very nice inside. 
but we are going out for dinner and to explore Whitehorse, which is down yonder. All right. Oh, yeah. oh I'm good. we're doing the thing. Should I be on the side? You already started. Just go. All man. right. Cool. Wow. I guess here we are. Way horse. <laughs> Finally made it. Feels like the trip's almost over, <laughs> but it's just beginning. It's, it's not true. Even halfway over. No, we're oh, only two God. weeks in out of six. Yeah, third over. But that's not what this is about. We've made it to, I feel like, one of the um, milestones of this trip. Definitely. Yeah, so this is a big one for, I feel like, a lot of all of us, really. You can't believe where we are. Whoa! Oh. I see what you did there. <laughs> <laughs> Can you explain what you did there? I didn't get it. Well, you see, <laughs> we're in the Yukon! Dun, dun, dun. Hey! Oh, joke. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> Joke explained. Yeah, that's it. Um, and we're in, I guess, the historic part of downtown, really. Just yeah, near the White Pass route, it seems. Yeah. yeah. There's there's a ton, a ton, a ton of history in this area, so I'm not going to go through it. <laughs> if you're interested, check out Wikipedia. <laughs> Insert link below. But we will be seeing some cool sites, which we will explain. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we're going to do lots of fun stuff, like have some dinner, which is what we're doing right that's now. That's pretty fun. Oh, yeah, we're dinner. Hungry. It's the Yukon River. It's moving fast too. Real fast. We're hoping we can paddle this in a day or two, but we're gonna find out. There he is. There's people jumping in, which crazy. I'm gonna pass on. <laughs> Danger, no diving or jumping. Fast moving current may cause death or permanent injury. It sounds risky. <laughs> we're all about the not so risky risks. Day 16. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> First stop, the top of a mountain. So that happened. Oh! oh my god. Oh. <sighs> Oh my god! We survived the river! <laughs> there we go. 